Hello everyone and welcome to the collaboration session. Today we'll be reviewing the Backbone Project for uh, some revisions and finish work. I've got two of my colleagues in here, Zach and Gabe, and they'll be joining me for this session. Um, just to let them know really quickly, if uh, you guys have any suggestions or feedback, feel free to flag me down. So, everybody ready? Let's do this. All set. Okay, looks like they're both ready. All right, let's get to work. I've got an idea over here. Oh, looks like Gabe's already got something. Um, hang on, I'm on my way over there. Okay, go for it. I don't see the need for a second sink out here. Okay, so Gabe says he doesn't see much need for another sink out here on this area. Okay, I can sort of see that. Um, I, mean, I guess we have a sink inside. I don't know that. Uh, shift the barbecue over? What if we remove it and shift the barbecue over? Okay. That would free up some and, space. Okay, I see where he's going with that. So free up some more counter space and actually give you a nice little prep area. So let me see what I can do with that. Okay, so I'm just gonna let's actually get rid of that. Uh, get rid of the sink. I'm gonna shift uh, both of these over, and then what that'll do is give me some space right next to the door, make the uh, prep area a lot easier to work with. So, so something like this. Much better. Thanks. Okay. Looks like the step is a little high here. Okay, Zach's got a question. Why is there a closet there in the bathroom? Okay, I'm going to just jump to his location see where he's talking about. Okay, his Looks closet. Looks like it's bathroom access only. Yeah, that's access is from the bathroom. That's interesting. So, do you have any suggestions for this particular one? Because it is kind of an awkward place to put a large closet way back in the bathroom. Let's move access to the dining area. So move the door access to the dining area. Okay. Okay. What that'll let me do is uh, that'll actually make it into more of a uh, pantry. So that's actually a pretty good idea. And I'm just gonna go ahead and jump over here, click edit, and jump over to Revit. And let me see what I can do. So there's my wall. Uh, let's go ahead and pick a 34 by 96 door. I'm going to just go ahead and insert that and then remove the other one. And that'll just basically give us a kitchen access uh, pantry. Okay, quickly, I'm just going to flip us over to nighttime. Just let them know um, that I want to check the lighting arrangement. Make sure that uh, everything's looking good. Okay. There we go. Do we have any other materials okay. for this countertop? Okay, do we have any other material for the countertop? Let me just jump over to Gabe really quickly. And I assume he means this uh, black countertop we have in the kitchen. I think we have something for that. It says stone, but it's hard to tell. Okay, fair enough. Let's see what options we have. Maybe granite? Granite? Okay, granite's a good idea. Let me see what we got. Uh, stone countertop. Let's go ahead and do a search for granite. Yeah, looks like we do. Okay, and just to give it a little more realism, I'm going to add a reflective coat on that. There we go. So, more like this. Excellent. Keep that one. Okay. Okay, so we've got this view over here from the exterior of the house. Looks like the lighting plan's working out pretty well, especially I in the pool lights. I think the grill area could use more light. Zach says he thinks the grill area could use more lighting. From here, I think he might actually be right. Let me see what I can see up here. So hold on, let me see what I can do. 
especially on this side, this side. Uh, which side? He, oh, okay. Looks like he's already got it marked. Yeah, there it is. Okay. So one second, I'm just gonna go ahead and let's place another one of these lamps on the other side. So I'm gonna go place selected and let's flip this around really quickly, and it should actually add some more light to this area. Okay. So how's that? down just a little bit can we make it brighter with a cooler tone okay so want the light a little bit brighter and maybe a little bit cooler tone okay let's go ahead and do that let's, let's just apply it to all well, let me see yeah so that's a cooler tone and let's just go ahead and apply changes to the entire lighting family see what she looks like okay there we go So, better? Alright, that's perfect. Alright, okay. Okay, that's good enough uh, session for now. I think that's all we have time for. So, I'm just going to switch this back over to daytime. And let's wrap this up really quickly. Uh, before I forget, um, I'm just going to run through the annotations really quickly. Garage entry. There's mine, and and here's that step he was talking about earlier. Let's just double check that really quickly here. And yeah, it's definitely too high. Okay. So it's been a good session. Um, what I'm going to do is I'll just uh, generate a report for this and distribute it out to the team. Thanks for joining in, and I'll see you guys next time.